Well, she captivated viewers in power, and now Leela Lauren joins Altered Car Carbon, where technology has advanced, human bodies are interchangeable, and death is not permanent. Things are a little bit different. So she steps into the powerful role of Governor Danica Harlan, who tries to keep the peace while going head-to-head -head with some stubborn opposition. Take a look. We all know how the Protectorate loves to tack their toys. We can track the sleeves biometrics. By all means, track away. But I have no doubt you'll find whoever did this was acting alone. The people of Harlan's world are committed to peace. It's foolish to think you can make peace with terrorists. You should have crushed the Kellists instead of cowing to them. Your father understood that. I am not my father. No, she mm. is not, and Leela is with us now. Welcome back. Good to see you. Yeah, thanks for having me. Looking gorgeous as ever. My goodness, I love this dress. Um, so this is your first season with the show. What's it like joining this cast? Oh, it was so much fun, and it was, you know, getting thrown into a whole new arena, and it was a, it was a total blast. I had, I had so much fun. Yeah. Well, Simone Missick was here this week, and she said, she also joining this season, said that she had to watch the first season twice to wrap her head around. Just yes. like, was it easy for you to jump in? No, 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 no. I definitely had to watch the first season also twice. I think I, yeah. like, I didn't know what was going on. I was like, what? <laughs> but then yeah. once I did, I really fell in love with it. As a, these, all these sort of deeper, philosophical, human themes that are really fun to explore. Yeah. Now, you play the governor. Yeah. Is she a good person? She wants peace, but... So Harlan's like <laughs> it's, it, tricky. <laughs> it's, it's a tricky situation. She's she's in a situation where the protectorate is sort of an imperialist regime. So it would be sort of like Britain and, and India together. And so she's wanting her own autonomy from the protectorate. She's also wanting peace. Hmm. But the question all remains is how does one go about getting those things? Yeah. yeah. So this is hmm. set um, hundreds of years in the future. Yeah. And Simone, Simone also said that it helped her create, you know, make her own creative choices because nothing, you know, it's the unknown several yeah. hundred years from now. Yeah, so well, kind and of death, that. death isn't a scary thing anymore because yeah. they've conquered it. So then what do, where does mm. fear reside? Like, what happens? Boredom all of a sudden is a much bigger issue. Yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> <laughs> you know, yeah. But let's talk about your wardrobe in this <gasps> oh, show goodness. because your wardrobe in this show is so amazing. Did you get to pick things? Did you have any say in it? Do you keep anything? Do you keep anything? <laughs> Uh, um, Cynthia Summers, the, our wardrobe designer, our costume designer, Altered Carbon, was such a visionary, and she had this amazing board. And from that, we got to sort of look at uh, a, a lot of what we picked is like what fits my frame. Yeah. You know, because when you're a small human, yeah. <laughs> you, you yeah. Really, you know. <laughs> um, and from there, we sort of built uh, Danica's wardrobe, and it was so fun to have everything custom built. So yeah. this we all like know power is very ready to, to wear high-end fashion of this time and to, to get to well, think of what the future away. looks like in yeah. terms yeah. of femininity and leadership was really no exciting. I had it was just amazing. Just well, let's talk about another show you're joining, American Gods, over on Stars. Yeah. Tell us about your role on this. Well, the I play Marguerite Olson. Very, very different. Marguerite's got like her sweater and plaid game <laughs> on another level, maybe even mom jeans. Oh like, boy. I can't even picture she's you in also, that. Uh, oh, that's actually my natural state. Yeah. <laughs> you probably make them I look very chic. As well. Very chic mom <laughs> jeans. <laughs> so like, no, it's a total different departure. So that was, it's been really fun. And I've had a blast with Ricky Whittle. And uh, I'm excited for you guys to see. Such a great show. Oh, so comfortable. <laughs> yeah. So um, you wrapped Power, mm -hmm. which was the second most highly watched show on cable. Huge success. Did you ex anticipate it to be as big as it was? And what was it like being part of that legacy? I don't think any of us did. We were sort of the little engine that could. Yeah. And that's yeah. what made it so rewarding to see it uh, gain momentum and still gain momentum. Yeah. You know, the other day I was out and... These girls were flipping out because they just started watching it, and it was really exciting to get kind of new viewership. And then there are all these yeah. spinoffs and yeah, things happening. That's yeah, gonna be, that's going to be interesting, a right? Yeah. <laughs> all right, well, it's so good to see you. Thank you so much. And season two of Altered Carbon begins streaming on Netflix Thursday. Great to see you. Congrats. Right, take care.